Uh, hello there, YouTube. This is Ian Math with Seven here. Uh, it has been a while since I've made a video again. Um, well, right now I'm in the middle of finishing up a Gerber file for something that I'm uh, design helping design, but uh, so I've been tagged by Martimer81, which is interesting because I didn't even know that. Uh, when you got to be a big user like that, you know, I always thought that all of the little peons that commented all looked the same. Um, guess not, though, which is interesting. Uh, so anyway, Martimer81 has tagged me to give my favorite scientific theory and my least scientific theory. Um, that's actually pretty easy favorite scientific theory, uh, quantum mechanics. Uh, yeah, what, quantum mechanics is just plain awesome. Uh, the mathematics used is absolutely uh, beautiful in some cases. And even when it's not beautiful, it's still interesting. And it's a difficult subject, uh, there's no denying that, but it's difficult in a way that it's actually fulfilling. And uh, also, uh, when I first used Schrodinger's equation to derive the properties of the hydrogen-like atom, and all of a sudden all this stuff that I learned way back in chemistry started falling into my lap. Uh, it was like, wow. Uh, yeah, it was great. Also, you know, quantum mechanics, that's like one of the scientific theories that's most amenable to, like, philosophy, right? Uh, you can find all kinds of philosophers of science with their interpretations of quantum mechanics. Uh, and by the way, if anyone's going to ask me what my interpretation of quantum mechanics is, uh, I'm currently kind of wavering between consistent histories and relational quantum mechanics. And you can look both of those up if you don't know what they are. Anyway, uh, least scientific least favorite scientific theory. That one's also easy. Optics. And I fully realize the irony of saying that even though I wear glasses and I'm recording something from a video, but I, I just don't like it. It... Ah! Uh, I don't know what I like, what I don't like about it, but I said quantum mechanics was difficult in a way that was fulfilling, I, I get no pleasure out of doing optics. I don't like it. Uh, like, when I first did any kind of more in-depth optics was in a modern phys intro to modern physics class that I took, uh, where it was wave theory, then optics theory, and then basic special relativity theory. Uh, and during the entire optics period, I just absolutely hated it, and then the instant we started going into special relativity, then it started becoming a lot more fulfilling. So, yeah, favorite scientific theory, quantum mechanics, and quantum chemistry in particular, because, you know, that's kind of where quantum physics, chemistry, and computer science, too, kind of go together. Computer science, because you know, you have to do algorithms in order to solve a lot of problems in quantum chemistry, don't you? Um, yeah. <sighs> Who should I tag? I don't have a lot of subscribers, so I don't really have a lot of options. Uh, I'm not going to tag Invincible Numinous because he would kill me if I did. Um... Who would I tag that would want to answer this kind of question? Um, I guess Agent of Doubt. Um, hmm. 
I, I guess I'll tag Dr. Jason J. Campbell. I mean, I know that he is more philosophy, but it, it'll be interesting to hear what, if anything, he has to say on this. So, Agent of Doubt, J, uh, Dr. Jason J. Campbell, and Stoned Commander. Those three are the people I'm tagging. Uh, so, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is Ian Math with 7, and see ya.